Welcome back to the channel. Today we have an LCR meter DE5000 that won't calibrate with any probes. Um, we have these brand new probes and an old probe and it won't calibrate. So let's check whether or not it will calibrate. Uh, you click on here. So it failed. So let's let's do it again. Okay. Okay. So this one, the pros have to touch. So now they're touching. So let's see. So it failed. Um, okay, now, now let's go ahead and remove these probes and try with another set right here. And let's do the calibration one more time. Open. So it's, it's not going to work. So we have a 510 ohms resistor here. I don't think this is going to work. Um, so all the values are crazy here on the display. Yeah, open loop, yeah. Usually these devices go bad if you, um, if you measure a charge capacitor so, um, so even here, if you if we read the warning here, the charge capacitor before test. So we are going to open the unit and see if um, if we can find out what is wrong with it. So let's go ahead and open the unit. Here, we're going to look in this area where all these resistors are and check whether or not they are the right values. If we find one that is, it is not the right value, we're going to replace it. Um, here is the board under the microscope. The resistors that are most likely broken um, R32, R33, and R34. R32 is supposed to be at 100 ohms, R33, 100 ohms, and R34, 1 kilo ohm. So we are going to check the values of those three resistors and see if they are, actually, they are close to those values. If not, we're going to replace the resistors. This is R32. So no, it's more than 20 mega ohms, so there's something wrong in there. Um, what about R33? Yeah, it's a huge value in there. Let's check this one. 
So now it all three are giving me mega ohm, so that's wrong. Um, uh, let's check the other ones. Uh, The first step is to remove the old components, so let's go ahead and remove them using our uh, using hot air. Okay, so we are done with R33, so let's do um, R32, sir. so let's go ahead and show you the parts for R, R33, 100 ohm resistor, this is the part number. And for for R thirty four, this is the part number. Some flux. We don't need a lot of flux. Now.
let's turn, turn it around. Uh, this probes in here and let's try to calibrate. Calibration. These two have to touch during the calibration. The alligator clips. Now let's start the calibration. So it passed both calibrations. Now let's try to measure some resistors and capacitors. I don't have any inductors, so let's see. let's zoom in. Okay. Uh, if I am not mistaken, this is a 510 ohms resistors with 10% uh, error. So let's go ahead and measure that. And see what we get here. We get 0.51 kilo ohms, which is 511 ohms. So that's correct. Now let's let's go ahead and try a capacitor. We're measuring a 10 milli, 10 milli ferrets uh, capacitor, and we get. 9.12 millifarads so it is within the 10% error so this LCR mirror is now fixed I hope you found this video helpful well guys this is the end of the video if you like what you saw make sure you click the subscribe button thanks for watching